next day. It's moving. We have everything in the back. I don't know how we even fit stuff in this car because, mind you, this car is tiny. Like, this is a really small car. So, we try to fit as much as we can, and we're only bringing one car somehow. And it's gonna be really nice because we don't have to, like, drive two cars and waste gas, you know? So, basically, we're gonna go to a store pretty close to our house where we could get cleaning stuff to clean the house just because a person lived there before only for four months. But we also want to, like, keep the house clean. And I'm gonna give you guys a house tour. So, I'm so excited. Welcome to my house. This is the house tour that we have all been waiting for. This is the house that we chose. This is a three bedroom house and it has a washer and dryer and it's 1,800 square feet. So that's all the details you need to know for now. Come on in. Here's the entrance. Onto your left, have like a little hallway. I'm sorry if it's like a little bit ugly. It's like there's nothing on the walls yet. It's literally an empty house tour, you guys. But right here, there's the guest bathroom. So anybody that needs to use the bathroom, they come in here. So there's drawers and a little bathtub. And then on your left, we have a guest room. So in here, I'm probably gonna put my bed that I have in my room right now. And then probably put like a little dresser, maybe a TV right here. And then there's also a closet here that has like a lot of room. <laughs> it looks so little. <laughs> So also down this hallway, we have another room and it's probably going to be the office. It's like pretty big. It's like probably the same size as the other one. But one thing I really like about this house is that the ceilings are very high. So it just makes the room look really big, even though it's like small in here. But we also have a closet here. So we can have, put a bunch of like stuff in here. And then over here, we're probably going to put a table, like a long table. And that'll be Caleb's side and then my side. So nice in here because the sun hits here during sunrise. And then the sunset hits over there, which you guys are going to go see. So let's go. So after this hallway, we're back at the entrance and then we're gonna go to the living room and okay so over here is gonna be the dining table we're gonna put like a little table right here and this is the living room you gotta show it Damn. and this is the living room so we're gonna have a tv right here and then we're gonna have our big couch right here which on the works and then we have our outside space the owner said that they're gonna put a uh a fence around so it's gonna be really nice because we have a dog named Mel and she loves going outside She doesn't have that like, choice to go outside like that like in a fenced area So it's gonna be really nice for her. But anyways on this wall we have our room door So this room is actually pretty big and I'm so excited to do like a room transformation in this video in this house in this room uh, <laughs> Our bed's probably gonna go right here and we're gonna get like a king size bed And I'm so excited about that but coming over here there's a big bathroom So you walk in right here there is like a toilet I'm gonna take all the dickies. There's two double sinks and then there's also like a little towel towel rack or something like that for, for hand towels. I didn't even know they had this. Behind this door, they have like a little storage space to put towels and stuff like that. I was literally like going a little crazy over the fact that they didn't have storage space when we first viewed this house. And then when we went to go see it the second time when we had to measure stuff, I realized that there actually is storage space in our bathroom and I was stressing about that. This will come in handy. But honestly, there's so much storage space down here. And then we also have like this big drawer right here. And then here is our shower. This is like very spacious. And I love like how it's glass right here. So we don't have to put like a curtain. It makes it look a lot better. And also the lighting in here is so good. Like I'm so excited to film videos in here. It's gonna be so nice. Then we have our closet in here. And this is what it looks like. We're probably gonna take these off and like have a full design one by Ikea or something like that. So it's gonna look a lot better. And then we're gonna move on to the kitchen so this is gonna be the kitchen where i make food and i'll be in my cooking era and you guys are gonna see me i love how there's a window right here it's just so nice i always like the kitchen windows it just looks so cute and then there's also a dishwasher and then we also have a microwave and oven and fun fact the second time we went to go view the house we didn't even realize this the first time but the second time we came here to measure stuff i opened this up i literally have a video of me open up and like being like what the heck but this is actually blue and i didn't even realize this because i've never seen something like blue inside of like a microwave or an oven but it's totally fine like it's not like you can see it. There's also some more storage space. And then this is a gas stove, so it's like really nice. Look how cool it like lights up. And then we also have one of these. I don't even know what these are called, but I love this style. Being in a kitchen instead of having a microwave over the stove, it just looks really good. Also, underneath here, we're probably gonna add light. This is our fridge. So it's like the double fridge where it's like freezer on this side and refrigerator on this side. Pretty nice. We don't really need a huge fridge just because it's just me and Caleb. So we don't need like that much food. And then here's our pantry. And somehow there's paint over there. 
Here, I think is like a little coffee station. So there's some storage space here too. We can put like coffee mugs or something. And then there's also more space down here and like little drawers. I'm super excited because I don't like coffee, but Caleb does. So it's gonna be really nice for him to have like a coffee station. And then I can make my like matcha or any other drinks that I like to do. And I'll do it like right over here in this little space. Anyway, but there's a door right here and this goes to the laundry. So this already came with a washer and dryer. And one thing I was like stressed about looking for a house is like if they had a washer and dryer and I had to like buy one but this is really nice that they have one so it's gonna come in handy and then right here i'm pro probably gonna put like a wood shelf like two wood shelves so we have more storage for stuff because i don't really think this is gonna hold everything and we also don't have a closet in here like this is a ac thing i don't know like electricity and then at this door is the garage and what we're actually not gonna put our cards in here we're gonna put a gym like we're gonna build a gym caleb is because me and caleb love the gym and he personally probably loves it more than me so he's gonna build everything and he's had a gym before so he knows how to build it I have like a mirror right here he's like bench set over there this could be cool you guys are probably gonna see him film a video on that on our vlog channel so you guys could go check that out i probably won't be filming that because he knows everything about gym but we're gonna slowly grow that like we're not gonna do that fast and Fast. That's the pool house tour. We're gonna start putting all of the stuff in the house, like all of our boxes that we got. And then we also brought a vacuum. So we're gonna vacuum the floors so that everything is clean. And then once we're done with like packing everything, like putting everything inside, we're probably gonna go to the store and get like simple little things for the house, like a soap, cleaning stuff, like little towels, toilet paper, just simple little thing to live in here. But we're not living in here. It's just for us to clean the house just so that we can like move even more stuff. My parents are gonna come here and they're gonna drop off the TV They're also gonna help us with the light in the living room and all the rooms because there's no lighting So we need a ladder to like reach up for it since it's high ceilings We're like super excited and i'm so grateful you guys i'm not trying to brag in any shape or form Like the reason why i'm talking like so great like just so much energy is because I have literally so much energy Because i'm so excited for this new chapter that me and caleb are walking in like we are so grateful And there's so much to come and i'm like so excited to document it all so that we can look back one day and see all all of this yes yeah, there is so much to come and we cannot be more excited later i kind of want to tell you guys the story of how we got this house because honestly it was definitely meant to be and we don't even know how we got it like i'm still shocked that i'm here sitting in this house telling i'm not sitting i'm standing but i'm here like telling you guys this it's just crazy to me and i just did a house tour like my first home our first home me and caleb and we worked really hard for this house like we genuinely we did long distance and the fact that we have a house that we can live in now and don't have to do long distance don't have to get like airplane flights is just a blessing truly and now we're getting married and yeah we're just so grateful and we're so excited up at ikea now we're gonna go to or oh, this is dark now we're gonna go to the grocery store and get some cleaning stuff we just got basic stuff here we honestly didn't even think we we're gonna get this much things but we did pretty good i'm gonna give you guys a all of what i got from 
from Ikea and the grocery store, so. Starting off with Ikea, I got some plates for obviously the kitchen. I got this bowl. I got gloves as well so I can clean the house. I got two of these for the bathroom for hand soap. I got three of these containers. I actually saw these on Pinterest and I thought they were so cute. Got these for the bathroom. I got two of these. Just use the bathroom. <laughs> and then we also got this trash can for the guest bathroom. And then moving on to the grocery store, like the cleaning supplies that we got. I got two of these Aramis for the bathroom. I got a bathroom stain for gel and then I also got softener and also from Ikea I forgot to show you guys but I got this little bowl for like fruits and stuff too the other one's like pretty good for fruits like bananas and stuff and this one's just to serve but for the bathroom I got the toilet cleaner I also saw this on TikTok and then I also got this towel for the kitchen anyways that's everything that I got and now I'm gonna put everything away and start cleaning the house Caleb already started swifting the floor with these I forgot what these are called the mop it's for mopping but like water comes out of it you like click this right here and it comes and yeah <gasps> look at it, it's pink to show you guys i got these rugs for the bathroom we were like so indecisive on what to do but we got three because we're gonna put two on the sink sides in my bathroom i'm gonna go show you guys it's gonna go under each other's sinks we're like so indecisive on what to do here like get a small little towel and put it right here or what this is like all my bathroom stuff like my makeup all of it. like extra makeup product it looks pretty cozy in here now i think that looks really cute it definitely matches and it's super comfy honestly getting out of the shower i could just go right here i don't have to go like from there Let's start putting everything away. Oh, and we also got this curtain for our bedroom, so we're gonna put that up. I just put the softener and the detergent in here and I'm just gonna clean all the towels because you don't know like who touched it and stuff so I'm just gonna clean it real quick and then we'll like start using that stuff. Yeah, this is my first time using it. dispensers so i'm gonna put soap in here and then we also got these aramis so i'll probably spray it like a little bit in here why like barely anything in here and then here's like the soap that we're gonna put in these little dispensers i think they're so cute and like so minimalistic so me and caleb are gonna have one on each side but i'm gonna start off by deep cleaning just the sink area and maybe like the dra the drawers this stuff and it's just to clean it but i was like so excited to use it because it's pink but you just like leave it in for 10 minutes i literally look stupid getting excited about something like this but i'm just gonna leave this in for 10 minutes and then brush it and like do it i'm gonna do it on the other toilets too which we only have another like one Thank you. 